Welcome to the Digital Moneta channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to overclock the Antminer Z9 Minis from Batch 2. These were the ones that were released in August of 2018. They were released without the ability to overclock from the configuration tab. In the past you'd go over here to your configuration tab, advanced settings, and you would be able to click on this drop down box and select uh, overclock like 750 or or 700 and it would allow you to overclock and people were achieving uh, 16,000 souls by overclocking well that feature was removed from the August batch so now we are going to take a look at how to overclock right now this miner has been up and running at about 11,000 souls is what it averages and we're you know not disappointed in that but we certainly wanted to see the ability to overclock so we are going to jump over to the advanced tabs under minor configuration and we right click on the drop down box and come down here to inspect element click on that and that is actually going to open up the code so we can change or overclock this miner. So it will bring you right to the correct area and then you'll click on this arrow next to select ID ant freak, F-R-E-Q, frequency. And when you click on that arrow, it will show you the value they have set for balance is 500. So if we click on that right 100, and select edit as HTML we can actually go in here now and change this to whatever we want uh, we're going to go ahead and do 650 for our overclocking so now we can see that the balance option has been changed to 650 so if we're down here and you're looking at 650 is now going to be our balance option. We'll come over here to the save and apply. Click on save and apply. And this will reboot the miner. Okay, so our miner is rebooting now. We can see it's rebooting. And if we go back over here, you'll notice that there's the balance and then a blank. So if we actually click on the inspect, go back to that inspect element, and click the down box you'll see you'll see that it defaulted back to the 500 there but when we jump over to the minor status we'll see that our frequency has now gone to the 650 so we have actually made the change however you won't necessarily see it under the advanced tab you'll see a blank or the balance option and if you choose the balance option it'll take you back to that uh, 500 megahertz or that 500 frequency and so our miner is rebooting and we can see we're already up to 11 and if we wait about two minutes we will see the fr the hash rate get up to around 14,000 is what we saw when we did this earlier uh, at the 650 frequency and the other thing to look at we actually tried 700 and the 700 frequency two boards would work we'd have all all the O's but the third board would be all X's and was not working at the 700 so for some reason this miner won't accept the 700 frequency we dropped it back to the 650 and we saw that it was actually working here we can see now we're achieving that 14,000 souls. So we basically increase this 3,000 souls, which equates to about four 1080 Ti uh, gra GPU graphic cards. Just by changing the frequency, we essentially added four 1080 Ti uh, GPU cards to this little unit. So that's quite a jump you know an extra 3,000 souls by a simple change in the frequency 
And I think that's going to kind of wrap up this video. We just wanted to hop on, give everybody an update on how to overclock the Amp Miner Z9 Mini Batch 2 Miners that just came out in August 2018. And just keep in mind, if you choose to overclock your miners, that might actually shorten the lifespan of that, uh, of that miner. So that's kind of a decision you need to make. But that is just a quick video on how to get it done. Uh, until next time, if you could do us a favor, spike a like button. That will actually help people find this video if you found it helpful. If you didn't like the video, please leave a comment as what we can do to improve. And be sure to subscribe. We're going to have more updates as we figure out more about these miners. So by subscribing, that will help you get any future updates. And until next time, keep passion away, and we'll see you in the next video.